I am delighted to be back with you, Karuna, and ask you what always is my favorite question, it seems, because I get some amazing answers. But influencers do come in all sizes, shapes, colors, you name it. They come sometimes for a second. Sometimes they last a lifetime. Um, can you share with us, you know, two or three people or however many um, that have been influencers in your life? Sure. Um, I think I'd have to start with my father, who I think has influenced me in terms of um, he is uh, 92 and um, has had multiple careers, including um, as a diplomat, as um, someone who worked for the UN. He um, and the way he's really influenced me, he's a remarkable learner. He's always, um, you know, even well into his 50s and 60s, he was learning new languages, um, learning new software programs in his 70s. I mean, he just never stops learning. So I think that's um, something I really, um, you know, has influenced my life and, and the value of education. But beyond that, learning on your own. Um, I would say some of my first bosses um, when I worked at PG, Jim Stengel. Um, Chip Berg are uh, two that come to mind, but many others who really taught me what a great leader um, looks like and um, how much they care and how they make it can make such a lasting difference in your life. And, you know, 25 plus years later, I, they are still my mentors and, and um, people I turn to when I make any major career decisions, but um, also life decisions. So, um, those would be another um, two. And then um, I'm going to give you a couple more. One, one other is uh, the amazing women, um, both in my life, but also women I admire, um, everyone from the Prime Minister of New Zealand um, to Maria Shriver to Michelle Obama, who are um, do an amazing job of bringing motherhood and leadership together. And I think um, I've always said, you know, being a mom is some of the best training for being a leader. Um, so they, they really show you how it's done. And then lastly, and my husband's gonna be sad, so I should probably include him, but my kids, who are um, amazing in, you know, individuals who um, just, you know, teach me every day to look at the world, in, you know, through their eyes. So I think it's, um, it's important to do that. I mean, we used to talk about at the agency, you know, the eyes of a child. And I think that's so true. And so always having that um, openness and seeing the world continuing to, to change and evolve, um, hopefully keeps me from getting too old. No, I think it's a brilliant statement because, you know, it's, they always ask why. Well, because of this, yeah, but why? Because of that, yeah. well, why? And um, yep. it's, it, it's great to do this. So does Chip, um, did Chip wear jeans when he was at P&G? He did not. So it was really <laughs> funny when he went over there and I thought, oh my God, I can't picture him. But um, yeah, he and I actually did a mentor-mentee session um, not that long ago. I mean, we've been, you know, he's been my mentor for so long and it was a, uh, it was really fun because I think we actually had a, you know, he talked about it as um, I mentored him as much as he mentored me. And so that those are the kinds of relationships that I think really end up having a lasting influence. Yeah, those are the, the best mentors and, and also the best mentors are the ones that also champion you to yeah. the, the next An step. advocate for you. Yeah, absolutely. That's awesome. Thank you so much for sharing that. I, I'm happy to. So it's great speaking with you. You too.